What the fuck's going on lads? It's your favourite Jordy Pose coming at you with a brand new video now. I know I haven't uploaded in a long time, but let's not get into that. I've apologised so many times. Today's video I've got like a little topic to talk about and this kid keeps inviting me and it's pissing me off. But yeah, like I said before lads, I've finally got like something interesting to talk about. Well, not necessarily interesting, but I've actually got a topic and that is I'm starting my sleeve finally. I got a tattoo about a year ago now and it's just a rose tattoo i've been wanting to start a sleeve for so long getting praying hands now if any of you know who wampy is he's kind of got a similar thing but his his is going to be like a whole angel on his sleeve he said if you didn't see that his video about his tattoo but mine's not going to be like that my whole sleeve is going to be based on family i want to have like images but i also want to have quotes like my sister she's got a tattoo down our ribs like the whole side of our ribs and it's a poem that my granddad wrote because he used to like writing and he used to like making quotes and stuff so I may or may not get a quote that he done underneath or I might just get another quote to write underneath which resembles family kind of but yeah I'm so excited to start my sleeve if any of you have actually ever seen a TV show called Tattoo Fixers and you're actually old enough to get a tattoo. You can't turn around and say, "Oh, this doesn't make you. This doesn't make you want to get a tattoo." Because honestly, every time I watch it and see how good they are at doing tattoos, it just makes me want to get one every single time. And it's going to take four hours. Now, my first tattoo didn't even take an hour because it's not a big tattoo and there wasn't like loads of detail in the way. So I'm not looking forward to sitting down for four hours just sitting on my arse doing nothing. But yeah. It'll be worth it in the end, like literally, it's gonna be so nice. I've always loved the, the thought of praying hands, big, I just like the style of them. They look clean, and it's just a really nice tattoo. The only thing I was worried about, about getting this tattoo, is because I only like praying hands in black and white. If you've ever seen like sleeves where they're all like coloured and that, I don't think they look, well, it's personal preference, but I don't think they look that good. That's just my opinion. I just fucked that kid up. But yeah, like I say, it's just personal preference on like me not liking coloured sleeves. Because other people might love coloured sleeves and other people might be the same as me where they prefer like the black and grey. Now, the tattoo I've got on my arm is coloured. But I, see, I asked the tattooist if it would still look nice if I got a black and white sleeve with the one, like with only having this colour. And he did tell us yes, it would be fine as long as I only have one coloured thing, which is obviously going to be happening. I'm only going to have the rose. Now, to be quite fair, I did want the rose black and grey to start with. But obviously, the tattooist being a tattooist, he knows what looks nice and um, what doesn't and stuff. And obviously, it was my first tattoo, so. I didn't really know what would look best and he said just go for colour and if you want any more tattoos like the sleeve or anything just get the rest of it done in black and grey and it'll still look really nice. I will have that in a couple of weeks and I will show it in a future video. Basically said what I need to say I am getting a tattoo in the next couple of weeks I think it's two weeks now or three maybe I'm not too sure I can't remember. I think it is three yes it's three I don't even know but um yeah Hopefully you enjoyed the video, please leave a like if you did, subscribe if you are new and I am sorry that I haven't uploaded in a long time, I am trying to fix it all, as soon as my shifts die out and I get less hours I will be uploading a lot more but yeah, this has been your favourite Jordy Pause, hopefully you enjoyed the video and I'll catch you in a bit.